Hey, welcome to Sippy Cup Adventures of Cheers. Northern California. In this episode, we're going to tell you about a wonderful stay up here in Calaveras County in Arnold, this Airbnb that we found. So we're going to give you some more information about it. Again, welcome to Sippy Cup Adventures. We're a travel channel about places to travel in Northern California. So hopefully if you're thinking about coming out to California, our videos will be of help. Now, we don't camp and we don't hike. This is what we do. We get Airbnbs or hotels to stay at. So if you're into that kind of- Or glamping. Or glamping, if you're into that sort of thing and you're not into hiking or camping, then you'll like our channel. So, where are we at, Patty? Well, technically, we're in Avery, California, but it's really Hathaway Pines. But we are basically halfway between Murphy's and Arnold in Calaveras County. Yep, up on Highway... Four. Highway Four. I'm geographically challenged. <laughs> you got that. So yeah, this little cabin, we've, again, we found on Airbnb, and it's the two night stay, it's gonna cost us $600, so $300 a night, but you know with Airbnbs that there's cleaning fees um, and you know deposits and things of that nature. So, but you know, it's it's been a nice stay and we'll pay a little bit more if we know that we have no neighbors. You know, there's an Airbnb next door and they were a little loud last night, there's three families, but they're allowed to, to do that. So, but yeah. Just beautiful. Airbnb is our type of stay. So at this Airbnb, they did a really great job of giving you information about what's in the area. Now this is an old school binder, but <laughs> anyone who knows about mountain travel, there's not a lot of good reception. Um, cell service, especially for AT&T, is no bueno. Um, but this Airbnb has really good um, strength Wi-Fi, so you can search if you want to, but they did a phenomenal job on this book. So if you're a hiker and you're into that sort of thing, obviously there's so many trails, so much beauty out here, and so many, you know, so much available for you. If you're into day use, like we are, you know, day use river access or road accessible lakes, Lake Alpine is just up the hill and you can see that in this video that we did. That's incredibly gorgeous. And just up a little bit higher is Utica Reservoir and Union Reservoir. We're gonna see if we, we may get there tomorrow. Um, there's also Spicer Reservoir, uh, Mosquito Lakes, which is also in that video, and Highlands Lake. You know, river access. There's the uh, you know, Stanislaus River, Highland Creek, all different types of ac water access to be had. breakfast at um, Bistro Espresso 
really good. They have outdoor dining. Um, a friend of ours that we're up here visiting works there. He's the chef and really great food. We'll put pictures. Yeah, biscuits and gravy. How can you go wrong with that? Right. I had a croissant with egg, cheese, and bacon. Mmm, delicious. So at Bistro Espresso, on Tuesday nights, they have Taco Tuesday with live entertainment as well as live entertainment every Friday nights during the summer. Behind the restaurants, they have this picnic area or this community area where you can set up to listen to the music. Bring your lawn chairs, there's the stage, and they have seating as well. Grab your tacos on Tuesday and barbecue on Friday. And then this, the giant burger. Now we've had shakes from there and yesterday we just had fries and onion rings. We didn't want to eat a full meal, but. Snack. Yeah, kind of like a foster freeze type. Walk up, get some big giant burger. So that's a good place. That's a good place to eat, we've been told. But the shakes are great and the fries were great and the onion rings were great. Can't go wrong with that. Hey Darren, what about Snowshoe Brewery? Brewery. Brewery, there we go again. <laughs> we've been to Snowshoe, it, it, it's been a microbrew, it's been around for a long time, even before the microbrew wave hit. They've been up there for a long time and um, they're known for their pizzas and the last, one of the times we did visit, they did have a really good pizza. So, so if you like a pizza and brewery atmosphere, then it's definitely Snowshoe. In this video, it wasn't open yet. It didn't open till noon. And across the street is the Meadowmont. We've stayed here about three or four times because my brother has a camp up here. So we come and visit him occasionally in Dorrington. So we don't camp, so we're not gonna stay with all the snakes, bears, and scorpions, <laughs> scorpions spiders, and whatever. So we would oh stay my. at the Meadowmont. But now we got friends that live here in the Avery Arnold area. We could stay with them, but this weekend we chose this cabin because it was available. So. so, what do you do when your friend has a Hobie two person pedal kayak? First, you try and get Patty on. Okay. Then you get your buddy to nudge you. And what do we do? <laughs> we go in circles. It's uh, like NASCAR. <laughs> it only turns one way and not the way you want it to turn. Okay, take two. You got the technical difficulties worked out. Now we can steer. No more NASCAR. <laughs> There's our buddy Tony. He figured out the problem on the paddle, pedal kayak. Hi, Leslie. Hi. She now knows her friends are not total idiots. <laughs> <laughs> and Darren got me out in the middle of the lake on a kayak, which I never thought would happen. <laughs> <laughs>